I don't know how to describe it, I'm thinking. Um, or you, you can try to describe it through the story. I came here on a date with a girl <laughs> and uh, I didn't know about this space at all and uh, and after that I, I just fell in love with it because this is absolutely my type of space this here kind of has its own vibe so it's like all the people here is not the same but has the connection okay. has something in common this is not like a regular pub or something it's like a human community Everybody who came here drew something and the other one drew something as well. And this is common in us, so we make art. Or even if we doesn't, we saw each other and like, like encourage each other to express themselves. Picked up furniture and everything is handmade, uh, you know, things always break you have to fix them so it has this kind of familiarity for me so the first time when i saw this goya i was i was just amazed and i loved it They were more like literally old ruined buildings where people would just gather around and, uh, and have a beer. But uh, eventually it needed to close down because, yeah, it's not quite supported. <laughs> uh, by government? I think by government, yeah, yeah. Budapest and Hungary itself is very bleak. I no longer live here. I live in Madrid. I had to leave the country. I, I didn't feel that I'm secure, I have a future in here anymore. Um, and so I, I felt I needed to go. Uh, the government isn't very, uh, very keen on these youth spaces either. Why is that? Oh, well, I mean, I, I, I think it's, uh, it's quite obvious, you know, the Hungarian government is rather oppressive. And uh, with all its, uh, its power, it tries to uh, just suffocate all the efforts of, uh, of other types of ideologies than the ones that it, it has in mind. And for a while, the uh, 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 Budapest was more uh, in the hand of the right wing. And uh, now, you know, we have a... Uh, uh, um, we have more of a of a left wing uh, leadership, and ah, oh, that's a car. Oh, yeah. It's quite noisy. Yeah, but... yeah, there are too many of ambulances. I've noticed, like there. Yeah, there's there's a big hospital. I think around I there or there. I'm not quite sure. Okay. So there's like it's normal yeah, to have yeah, many ambulances. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it's it's just a deterioration of youth spaces. And the other thing is like, you know, this space itself is uh, proudly anti-capitalist. And I think that's also kind of the, uh, <laughs> the little tiny piece of stone in the government's shoes that okay. keeps bugging it, so. Do you think that places like this can change anything? Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely fucking lutely.